previously on The Real Forex Trader, Trading to Success. My name is Alexander Rose, um, and my truth is that that isn't actually my name. <laughs> um, my real name is Ellis Wolford, um, and I've actually known Sam and the rest of his team for a very long time now. And he kindly asked if I could come on board for this challenge um, but actually be an insider, uh, so technically uh, like a mole, um, and kind of vet out who's really cut out for this process, um, and you know, who's really, you know, dedicated to the process and who really, really wants this out of all of these guys, because they're hungry, but as you may be aware, we've got to chop them down. Um, and that's what I'm here to do, but on the sly. So, <laughs> that's me. But... For now, I'm known as Alexander Rose. Um, yeah, so yeah. Obviously, it's um, day two now, completed. Um, these were the three that was picked from you guys as the strongest three. And obviously, we've got to lose another person again today. I'll leave it over to these guys to um, tell you who it is. Yeah, so as Sam said, there was two of you guys who were um, had the most names and it was a hard decision, um, but the person we decided to send home is normal. And I think also um, the other person that was at the bottom. Yeah, we'd, uh, we'd like to talk to him this morning. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So um, that's, that's the day two finished. Day three is going to get more gruesome. And actually, day three's task um, actually lasts for three days until Monday morning. Again, I don't think this is going to get any easier. I think it's been absolutely amazing what you guys are doing on a day-to-day -day basis and um, starting to form those skills that's needed. So um, that's it guys, day two is complete and I will see you tomorrow morning. Yeah, it was a good experience, I met some really good people, really talented people um, and I wish them all the best. So today I'm going to split you into two teams. The candidates, they have no idea that this is the last challenge before we start trading and most of them are going to be going home. And those two teams you'll be working with for the next three days? A lot of people will be leaving us very shortly but I don't want those guys to go without knowing their true potential and I'm going to show them what they're truly capable of achieving. With a little bit of hard work we're going to show these people how to be real entrepreneurs and make money out of thin air. It's going to be an interesting one to say the least. You're going to be given an item, okay? And that item that you are given, you have to sell. <laughs> and the team that has the most amount of money by Monday is the winning team. So whichever team sells the first one today and come back to the office, if they do sell it today, and they get one more, which means that they can make more money than the other team if they have to sell them at the same value. In this, this is pretty much testing out the box thinking. You know, we're going down the route of what you look for, how you're going to build a strategy, how's it going to work. This is the last team building exercise there is. After this, we're on to trading and actually doing it. This is real life trading, so it's very different. So here are your two gifts. What name? What? Uh, what? Damn. Put the YouTube video up about what you were mining. I can't remember for. Yeah. I'll leave you guys with that, yeah. and Sam. I'll see you at 4:30. Okay. They've got a whole room set up. They had a whole room set up. Yeah. With There's one. Yeah. It's 15, it? Do you have experience? I don't have experience. Have you um, had experience in sales? Yeah, a little bit. I think there's a funny thing going on between me and Sam. Do you ever know contact people? Mm -hmm. With your contacts, see if you can find. Yeah, I felt like he felt like there's a threat for me to be in the team with him because then he can't take control of of, of, uh, of of the group. He said the best chance of us selling these things are hitting the forums, the Dash forum. Yeah, yeah. So Reddit, yeah. Dash, Reddit, Reddit Dash forum, get involved in there and send them on there. Six, six, six. Um, I'm and on any other Dash I'm forums. On I'm joining other crypto mining groups. I just think there's there's something between us. Like I wouldn't trust him, put it that way. Luke, like, yeah. do you want to, do you know how to use stuff like eBay yeah. and stuff like that? Do you want to just take some photos and just well, put it up really quickly place, just to see what interest you get? Yeah. Like, I can't leave. I can't leave until at least I'm in front of them screens and I've had somebody work with me and be able to show my capabilities based on trading, not based on building spaghetti spaghetti uh, towers or you know anything like that. Like, I've got family to feed and that's, that's the reason I'm here is to improve myself. 
and get that money. Since the Bitcoin crash, they've not had them running. Yeah. So clearly they're not that profitable because even if it was making a little they're bit, not, he'd, yeah, he'd, he'd have them like, running. This morning, no one's taking charge. There's, everyone's shooting ideas, but we've been just shooting ideas for the last half an hour and no one's actually done anything. Antminer S9 is yeah. going for like 51 pounds on eBay. Yeah, like they're going for pennies. It's hard because like there is so many leaders in the pack and no one's willing to listen and it's my personal opinion is going to be a disaster. Oh, Cheers. What if we sell them for let's say whatever they're going on eBay, take that two four hundred pound and turn that four hundred pound into more. Buy something else. Yeah, yeah. So that's you know what I mean? Shout, so. we, can, we can compound growth. Uh, yeah. Do you want to work on that? You work. Um, I'm going to work yeah. and just yeah, yeah, try. We buy them for one pound each. Yeah, that's like what eight quid? How many bucks are that? Sixteen pounds. Like, yeah. Sixteen pounds for two of them. We can meanwhile have a couple of people, one or two people, still you contacting your friends trying to sell them we can sell them again that money can go towards the end thing but it means we then get two other items to sell so they're getting four four items items both teams have put their neck on the line by buying some of their own products in order to get access to the second item how will they fare? That's our third item. You, yeah. you want to sell this? Great. No, just, <laughs> just so you're aware, this is like the senior officer's beloved pinball machine. <laughs> <laughs> so, so, we can look at things like you never buy um, and resell. Facebook Marketplace. Love it. Wow. I, can, I can see me being fuming at the end of this. Meanwhile. <laughs> so that's three t shirts yeah. and two hoodies. 30 quid. Three. three uh, you're increasing the price now, are you? Oh, is it 25? It was 25. It was 25. Oh, yeah. Okay. okay. That is still 25, don't worry. For five garments. Yeah. Yeah. Deal. We all Sweet. have that. Well done. Nice one. Thank, Thank you very much. much. Thank you. Thank you. We'll uh, be back in a set. So, I don't care that it's not 100 quid, it's a sell. Yeah, that's fine. We're doing like a promotion for the company. Is anyone interested in buying a t shirt or hoodie, whatever, and then they'll send an email around to everyone? First thing you need to know is your product and your marketplace. Where are you going to get this sale? Would um, you personally be interested in a pinball machine? <laughs> it's a really good one. <laughs> it's a good one. <laughs> it's pretty cool. Yeah, yeah. Obviously, the phone shop is not going to buy a pinball machine. And no. I say pinball machine first in crypto, because you're trying to sell some of the crypto thing, it's going to go over most people's heads. Yeah, we're doing all right. Sam has a clothing website that he's put it up on, um, and we're donating to charity as well. We are sorry that the 1321 Southern service to Milton Keynes. We're going to try and shift it until it's gone, mate. We'll get us uh, five pounds. Are you coming outside, sir? One is fine, one is fine. It's not bad. Well, as long as you mind. Thank you. Thank you. It's getting a lot wetter and a lot quicker. Three places and got brought back like hundred and thirty thousand yeah, like for another sale of ten pound, twenty quid from me for all my sales. Just keep them tens so coming in, boys. That's, more, that's more money. This is just money. That's money. That's that money. Keep, it adds so, up, yeah. keep them coming in. Get on the phone to your missus. Like some electronic say the thing is TX for about most of that time. Yeah. I say we split up into what, how, however many people and we all work on different ways of compounding yeah. our money. <laughs> you're, you're leaving. No, you know, you Do you know anyone that's interested yeah. in this actually? It's a cryptocurrency <laughs> mining machine, it mines Dash. No. You must have a cryptocurrency. Huh? No. You have it? Okay. Do you know any place that would consider buying something like that? No. Uh, oh, I need the answer oh, yeah. to have this part of the site. Because basically, oh, no. it, like, the thing is, cryptocurrency, the market's crashed. You might get lucky. Yeah. 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 We'll go back but we, need, we, we need to feed that back to the group, like plan B, because this is not working in terms of selling it at the price that we want. I don't think I'm right for this competition, really. I should probably call that day. We still don't have the option of cash converters by Yeah, exactly. Convinced we're going to find, we've got to be some marketplace online yeah. and get released. This is where we've got to be careful now, because we've obviously got a decent amount of money. So yeah. we don't want to be spending all of it all at once. No, nah, definitely not. We're going to go up there now to run and down, yeah. I'm hugging it, trying to make it not work. Go to the floor. Seven pounds. This shouldn't be gone by the end of the day. I know, I'm sorry, man. 
I knew this would happen. Well, well, some of these now we've got these to sell brand. and this. Yeah, not this one though. No. We don't physically have to sell it. Or do. It's the top. Very thin, but very snug at the same time. You've got five pounds up, eight pounds Can we make a decision on these ASIC miners? Because I think, I personally feel we should hold them. I don't think we should sell them because they run at a loss. How I'll wait in there. Yeah. Okay. So much. Thank you. Okay, um, guys here, so someone want to help me? Cash. It's good yeah, stuff. Is he local, is he? No. Uh, it took him He's 40 like minutes. An hour, it's about an hour he said to me, yeah. And how much did he sell it? 200 cash. Right. It's all been dismantled, so you got all it. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It's big one. Well, it is. No, we've got like a full size. With loads of legs on it and everything, yeah. If you have a look at it, that will be what it's like. Yeah, it's pretty big. Yeah, no, we, no, we fault, because it ain't for me. If it was for me, I'll I'll have it. I mean, to be honest, you don't want it too big anyway, you wouldn't got it in your car. What an offer did we have? It's at 200 pounds, yeah. I mean, we had an offer for 250, so it's only because he was picking it up today, so we're yeah, going I mean, 200. Like, I said if it was mine, it would bother me, but I'll show you. Yeah, Lee, it's, it's, not, it's not full size. So, not interested at all? No, he, he just said no. He, he just don't want it. He, want, he, want, like, he thought it was a full size one. Right. 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 Yeah, sorry, mate. It's, you know, right. I've come fault. all the way from North London, you know. Please mind the door. It's fine, it's the oh. first offer, you know, look, we'll get it, we had loads of offers. The only negative thing from that is one of us might be getting it now. If one of you don't want to get yourself, listen. This is how I've posted it. Liam, no, Liam, 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 Liam. Mm -hmm. so let's secure something, so we've got two minutes until we're done. Okay, alright then. So we can say we've got it, I mean like now. So, how's today gone? Good. Good. Well, yeah. I just saw you going, uh, lift. Yeah. Smaller than expected. Yeah. I've just secured a deposit off a guy. Okay, fine. Your team is now up. Seven. And your team is now up. 486. 486 and 50 pence. That's money in the back. Yeah, 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 that's the moment is down drastically. Okay, so what what you do now is completely up to you guys, and whether you go home, call it a day, and start again tomorrow, or see you on Monday, if you feel you're confident with where you're at. We can shift all of this tomorrow. That means tomorrow we can buy in the morning, then we can shift in the afternoon. Uh, today was a difficult day in itself, because now we're literally 70 pounds into the bank, but you know, it's not compared to what we've just found out for the other team, which is around 483, I think they've got. Oh, I'm loving it. I'm properly loving it, yeah. It's really, really good. Um, we're, like, we're all chipping in. We've all got some pretty good ideas. Um, made quite, a, well, what I think is quite a good amount of money off the T-shirts the that we got. And we've got a few backup plans. So, uh, if worst comes to worst, I think, I think we'll be all right. I think we'll be alright. I'll be disappointed if we're not. And my team are like, yeah, we're going to meet up tomorrow, Saturday and Sunday, we're going to sleep over, we're going to sell some more shit. We're all going to meet here at South Earth tomorrow morning. Some of us are staying on now just to do bits. Um, but they're doing well. Everyone just really wants it. Uh, what time is Burger Jumping? Need a large, need a large white. Yeah. Oh, well done, mate. Large white, yeah. Down. yeah. Good man. man, Luke's back <coughs> hitting the streets, boys. All right, good man. We'll hit the streets. Let us know. And I'm going to set all of this. Yeah. Mm. Do you know yeah, I can go and try and flog these shirts? It's better than the train station, mate. Or the Harry Potter pot. Uh, Harry, Lotto, um, pot Harry, Harry Potter. Potter lot. That's yeah. what I meant to say. They're just bombing past me. Hey, pound jumpers! Come on! No one here yet. <laughs> What do you want to do about financial things? Well, how much are we going to spend? What are you feeling comfortable doing? I'm, I'm more comfortable having a look in here, see what yeah. we can buy. 
Um, there's a whole lot of DVDs, things it's like that, which games. we could probably sell They're on. One pound. A couple of dollars yeah. here and there, but it was stuck. It'll up. add up. More money, more money, man. Just yeah. keep running. All right. All right, I'll go, I'll go and right. set this out, and then I'll give you a shout on Telegram. Right. Right. See you in a bit. Donated you some of the clothing items that we had, so we just come to drop it off. Well, that is very kind. We only started yesterday, but did we're you? Drop them off oh, now. we're very grateful. Yeah, there's a couple of hoodies there, and they're all brand new, so mm -hmm. right. They, that's what they deal with as well, so they yeah. might know contacts one, that might be interested uh, in. And, uh, you are, and, uh, maybe, uh, I need to speak to somebody is, that you are jeans. This people do like. All right, thanks very much, yeah, boss. No have no a great problem. day anyway. No yeah, problem. No problem. thank you. Though. I'll come back and hit up the fabric store when they open, see if we can make some more money today. So here I am back in uh, Watford, but I feel it's good because I've got home advantage obviously and that's exactly what happened yesterday, hitting up Camtax people I know. Team total yesterday come to like 400 and I produced 260 of it, so. We're just um, approaching people randomly. I had an appointment this morning uh, just due to um, another business outside of this at the moment, which I couldn't get around. Um, so, yeah, I arrived a little bit later, but my role was to sell the pinball machine, which I've done, I've secured that. When I arrived, I realised that we've put, they, well, they've decided to put £250 into stock, which we can't sell. Um, and they decided to, let's say, let's just go on the street and try and sell people cans of soda and, and chocolate bars, which clearly people weren't interested in. Come outside and have a bit of a chill. How you get on? Yeah, not bad, not bad. You're not coming out to Gigolo, are you? No. How are you? Is that why you're out here? Yeah? Nothing on top. Just made some sales, sold a few t shirts, so keep the money coming in. Uh, I'm not even sure, about, about 50, 60 quid from that. So, doing alright. How much have you been selling them for? Uh, six quid. Mate, good man. Brilliant. Props to you, you yeah. come back and... I've come back and absolutely <coughs> smashed it. And, yeah, uh, you know, there's people that aren't here today for various reasons. I'm not having a dig at them, but the fact that he is... Yeah. And he had a bad day yesterday. Yeah. And now he's come back and we've given him that yeah. confidence and he's absolutely yeah. smashed it. So, I don't yeah, feel like he should be got the one that's really? leaving, you know. Did you see? Harry said I'm bringing 150 in cold hard cash. Even better. For what? The well, the miner brother apparently, he just said he sold it for 100 and now he's saying he put bringing 150 in cold hard cash. It so means that well. bases on product, we've got about 20 items to sell and we're yeah. clear guys. And we have it. Like, I'm not sure about you, but I hate people asking me stuff on the street. Well look, I was basically voicing um, the issues, you know, I'm not trying to be pessimistic, but saying, look guys, look, at the end of the day, this is what we're trying to achieve. Would you buy it for that? And they were saying, no. So it's like, okay, right, so what? You know, so why would other people do that, you know? And he's going, well, why don't you come up with another idea, you know? And so I was like, well, look, you know, to be honest with you, I'm trying to think that through, but, you know, has anyone else got any suggestions? And he's just basically just really stressed himself out, Mark. The problem is we came up with an idea, we agreed, we went with the idea. It hasn't worked, but people are good at saying there's no, it's not working, but no one has come up with a solution. Um, it was just uh, Liam, I think he, we'd already been there, we'd already done a plan, we'd been there all morning, and he was just, Kind of like about our, what our plan was, like kind of digging at it, but wasn't really giving any solutions. So Mark, I think, had a little um, nag at him. We still have the pinball machine. We still have the ant miners. Now we've got 250 pound much stock. And then Ben kicked off in Nando's as well. Uh, Are we going to go get the champagne and so we can get some some sort of cash? Yeah. Are they able to transfer the money straight away? Yeah. yeah. I've had an issue just with my being. being with him saying about drink driving, um, it doesn't sit with me at all while drink driving. And then I think about 20 seconds later, I apologised and shook his hand and then was like, look, I'm sorry, I'm just wound up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm so just mind. brainstorming and then we're gonna just yeah. decide what our next move yeah, yeah. is. Oh, it would be a great achievement just to clear everything off the yeah, table yeah, and know yeah, that's yeah, all yeah. gone. Yeah. Yeah. Do you feel like you've learned yeah. stuff from doing it? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 be an interesting one Monday morning. Yeah. <laughs> Alright guys, I'm gonna go. Don't like right. it when you're smiling. Good luck. Yeah. Yeah. Don't, don't turn back. That, yeah, that horror yeah, that yeah, that that was happening Monday morning. I don't even know if I'm dying. Yeah. We've got a trolley, we've got a car. How many do you need? We're buying Prosecco. Currently, if they choose those ones, it's £177 uh, profit straight away. And 
just wait on answer for these ones. <laughs> Oh, to be fair, we'll get all that part off in the back. Oh, no, don't do that. No, we're not. No, we're not. No, 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 After no, no, our attack. No, no. We've sold both of the miners. Um, Taryn sold another one for 100. Um, just about to go and pick up some free electronics. Two printers, one of them's brand new, probably costing around a couple hundred pounds. Brand new, but we probably might not get that much. We might get 100 off. This is Sharon. Hi Sharon, nice to meet you Sam. Sorry about that, I generally enough to be giving us two. <laughs> the people inside are going to be like, what is happening? Well, Thanks again. Yeah, yeah, thank you so much. I'm so good. Thanks so much. Thank you. Bye bye. Oh, I didn't want to grab that one. Have we sold anything? Okay, nothing. Okay, so. What if we can now try and try and wholesale it or sell it as a group? Right. Um, let's find out. So let's we'll go do some quick maths quickly. So we need to get online and look at how much how much six cans of coke are in Asda, how much we paid, and then undercut Asda but still maintain us in profit. So let's try and undercut that. They should, probably, they should probably update that. That's a bit um, annoying, isn't it? Right, let's go put this in your home. Isn't there another one in what? <sighs> He's right. Amazed. I'm off. Uh, we're currently waiting for the eBay auction to end on the miners. Well, no, that's it. Someone's been like, fighting now. How long have we got there? That's it, two seconds. 52 pounds they've gone. Well, at least you've made a profit. I'm happy with that. Oh, I'm really not happy with that. I'm tired now. Yeah. Like. We've sold most of our merch, which is pretty good. We're on figures of like 80 now, which is. Top. Um, everyone's pulled their weights. A lot of people have improved. Luke's improved significantly today. Uh, I feel that's a really good thing. He's come up shot a little bit. Luke sold another four shirts. Ryan sold yeah, a shirt. I've sold another hoodie. That's all we've got. We've got eight. Eight. How, what have we got left now? Then? One medium, oh, three large, and three black. Three uh, six black mediums. So we're almost done. Yeah, it's been an enjoyable day. It's been an enjoyable challenge. It's been hard at times, but that's what it is. Front seat. Front seat's full. It's full. Where's the dog? I'll leave it to you. We did not pick this free. <laughs> that was a good idea, Ten. Hey. No plans to buy first contact with the enemy. We've got to adapt and overcome, yeah? Oh, I have no doubt you have to get out of your car because David Jonas is coming. Oh, my God. <laughs> Wanna explain to them? Yeah, how come we've only got how come we've only got eleven crates? Ah, well, what happened was, um, um, we've now just secured a um, signed Spurs print that we've just we've paid seventy five for and just sold it for one hundred and fifty. Anyone else? One more. <laughs> You'll be in those trees. <laughs> Hmm. <laughs> this is this is not this was not as good a plan as we thought. <laughs> Cheers. Oh what a day. Should we wrap it a second? Or pretty. Yeah. Still alive. Just a bit. Been going well so far. We definitely picked it up since yesterday. We literally had £10 to our name on Friday, which wasn't good. We managed to shift the pinball machine. We was actually selling it for 200 Uh Went to the owner's house, set it up for him. Had a nice chat, and he ended up giving us fifty quid extra, which was a nice touch. What's yeah, the one? What's the one you're in called? Uh, Adam's got England it to win the Guinness something is all just I've got. Look up, look up Six Nations rugby. And just win. join them all. Time for today. Little bit of dipping, dodging, diving, ducking, and weaving. Three hundred profit. Yeah, two two quick ones. Most of the teams in. Most of the teams have been contributing. Some members haven't. Off to Twickenham. We have just had a breakthrough now where we've. Join a group of people that are going to the game. Yeah. Take orders, write that. Take, take the orders, orders and then just say, give us a deposit for that order. If this pulls through, we're going to need both people. Yeah. Yeah. 
Or you need your car fist pulls through, you can get loads of orders in because yeah, yeah, then definitely. you can just go back and forth and start picking up hey, more stuff. I've got a big enough car to... I came in a little bit late today because I went to a few places to try and shift some uh, chocolate boxes and some Coke crates. Yeah, yeah we got seven. Well, we had seven. Last one. Uh, about 7.50. 7.50. Shaver. Well done. Just got to try and keep working hard and try and get to that target market. We've yeah, only got an hour left, though, so we need to track one. Yeah. Um, Our total's up to 9.56 pounds, 37 pence. We've got five items left on the table. G and two days of grind. Yeah, definitely. Good, eh? yeah. And two printers on, obviously, that are on their way out at the moment. Hopefully, we get something from that. And then, obviously, whatever the boys generate from today, we're just looking for free stuff that we can turn over. We don't want to risk spending our capital to gain more. We've got Alexander um, away on his birthday weekend. Dom's up in Kent selling and flipping. First of all, we've got a couple of phones here. Put this one in fully inboxed. Yeah, we've got that one with the charger. We've got the PS2 controller. The PS2 in there as well. And then we do have 20, new 22 PS2 games all in here. I'm just going to try and sell and shift for as much as possible. I've had my issues with Dom a little bit, um, but I actually just found out now, because I am quite open and honest and I've told Dom, but I just found out that he's, he's he's autistic, so that explains his energy, like, and he's always shouting over you, but, um, yeah. It's been a bit of a, a bit of a struggling, struggling driving day. Had a lot of driving to do, a lot of places to be. Um, traveling around with Kent to try and source as much free items as I possibly can. And now I'm just going into Canterbury to try and vlog those items for as much money as I can possibly get. Um. What's next? We're gonna carry on looking for free items on lunch um, in the local area. Like we could easily reinvest it in something and sell it, but it's a bit of a miserable day. Technically, like it's the weekend, isn't it? It's like for free time, kind of thing. We've got to still like graph and not slack, which is exactly what my team is doing, by the way. So CEX didn't take all my stuff, they only took the PS2 and the games and one of the phones. So I'm just going to go to another cash converters and check if I can sell the other phones. Still blocked up, as you can see. So I'm going to go check if there's the one other place that I can think of in the bay. But I don't think it's going to be open on a Sunday. They, all the shops close at 3, I think, so... Hey, I can only try. Try one more, see how we go. Not many people are out and about anyway. So we just can see what we can do with what we've got and what knowledge we have on the internet. We don't really know what Taran's doing. He has got back little this. contact. We've got limited contact with him, um, but he said he was flipping stuff um, in the local area. Um, Alex has just said he's not coming in um, all day, so he's out all day. Okay. Um, okay. Uh, struggling a bit with Liam today. Um, obviously, he didn't uh, come in at the same time as we did yesterday or today. Maybe baiting him out a little bit here, but it's. Uh, it's a team game and I feel like there is definitely one member of the team that's not contributing as, as much or being as part of the team as he should be and then coming in and, and causing some upset so recently just started getting some messages from him and it's just like none of it is is it's like he's just not been involved he's asking questions like oh so how are the like, ant miners doing What's up, boy? You part of the team today? Yeah. He's done more than Liam. It's <laughs> <laughs> just embarrassing. <laughs> he doesn't know anyone's name. It's been like a really enjoyable week, though, hasn't it? Like, I agree. How many days have we been in? A month? Six months? I don't know. <laughs> 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, <laughs> We've been yeah. a great team. We've worked our asses off. Yeah, we have. Yeah. Honestly, we have though. Have like, you met the Welsh note. ninja? <laughs> but we call him the Welsh ninja. The silent assassin. Yeah. Kill him. Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, ninja. <laughs> so in there is the ant miner. One of the ant miners. All packaged up, but we're going to go and post it now. I just, I really can't think of anything to flip. It's difficult. It's Sunday. A little bit wound up. It seems to be the same people doing. Um, all the work, you know, moving stuff all the time. And I'm sure that'll come across, and I'm sure that'll be seen by everyone. Yeah. So we could go back and potentially make loads more money, but then 
we're not going to get back here until like 9 pm because of the traffic. Oh, really? Yeah. And also, no it's Sunday. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. 810, is it? 810. Plus that. Hopefully, we're ticking it a grand. We've come up with an idea. That's actually, a performance. Yeah, Dale will be bottom. Liam has managed to move stuff. I don't think. Just because the guy's a bit, you can hold that against him if he can, if he is managing to move stuff. Oh, are the Bitcoin miners involved in that or yeah, not? Yeah, yeah, they've already done it. Either. Okay. Yeah. You know, he's clearly very intelligent. He's clearly very smart, but I think as a team player, he doesn't, he doesn't work well as a team. What's the total there now? Uh, uh, 882. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. The minute we've got another hundred coming in, just had a secondary idea onto the phone and the chargers and so on. Um, I know a friend who, who charges really temperamental, so I'm going to go try and sell this charger to them just to see if I can get up to that 35 mark because I don't really know what else I can try and do to, to try and help out the group. <laughs> have a few bags here with bottles of water, crisps, and chocolate and stuff made up. Um, Right. Yeah. Right. Do you just want to just take all them? Where's it from? It's from we're doing put, taking apart the challenge, and oh, okay. it's just stuff we've left over instead of wasting it. Um, we've decided to donate it. Yeah. Okay. Lovely. All yeah. right. Yeah. Okay. That's fine. All right. Nice. Okay. That's fine. So I can't drop off a piece of post. Okay, alright, thanks. So they're a post office and they're open, but they're not taking post today. Looks like we're gonna do it in the morning. Uh, so I've had to call it a day now. Um, still haven't been able to sell some items. But all in all, it was an alright day. Uh, still got £32.50 for the team. So, yeah. It was not what I expected, for sure. But it was something to get stuck into. I've done what was sort of allocated to me. There's only so much one person can do in a seven man team. You know, I think everyone's got to pull their weight in, in, in other areas. So, I didn't realise there'd be like 10,000 people all on one road. Um, we could have capitalised off that so much more if we just put a little bit of more time and effort into it, kind of realised how big it would be, um, kind of thought about it more, made a, a, a structured plan. But on the plus side, the other team thought about it and they didn't do anything about it at all. They've had pretty much all of Sunday off. I just did two two yeah. bits of clothing. Yeah. Jack did a bit of, one bit of clothing. I think they saw that we'd made like 60 quid on the first day. They'd made 480 and they got too cocky. Liam's had a lot to say. There's some stuff that was missed, especially today, which you'll probably hear from the other lads because it's more relevant to them, not me. But just just comments here and there, it's unnecessary. Yeah, and everyone's sort of cracking on. It's like, oof. especially when you wasn't really here today. I've had to go to an appointment in the morning. Uh, the team were okay with that. You know, I made sure that everyone's okay. Uh, and I've come along and, yeah, there's been some good progress. We've uh, done a nice charitable thing at the end um, with a few bits and bobs. So, yeah, it's been good. It's been a good day. I think so, what he says is quite calculated. Um, I feel like I've made a contribution, you know, to the team. So I'm confident in myself. You know, I think that there's a couple of team members um, that, I mean, I'd say dislike me. I think because of the incident in the first part um, where I was voicing a few, a few of my concerns. Um, but you know, if that's their problem, that's it. I hope that they don't maybe vote for me to leave as a result of maybe disliking somebody. I think they should look at it intelligently and say, okay, who actually made enough contribution to the task? No, I don't know how to judge him. I don't, I can't, don't trust the guy, pretty much. Yeah, seems like he'd do anything to get his own way. Um, have you counted, because we haven't got Dom's cash yet. Yeah, no, I'm just looking at what we've got here in cash. We're doing something nice, trying to end like a good, well, a stressful, Week on a high, I don't care if, if people know what I've done or not, it's not even about that. And quite frankly, I fucking hate it that people film and they do stuff like that. But yeah, um, certain people in the group didn't really seem happy about that we were just giving stock away. What did you get for any shirt today? Yeah. Yeah. 
end of the final day and yeah well I said in my last video that my bottom one was Dale um, that's now been surpassed uh, Liam he's like oh why can't we just set it for a pound well why are we doing this why are we doing that and as soon as he ever got as soon as like you know, he's like, oh, why are you giving that? Why are you giving them too many? Why are you giving that too many? Like he was like disgusted. He had to do it. And we're human beings. He had talking about people in a bad way, but he arrives late again, puts no contribution into the day, and then me having not the most colourful pasts. I on my one page thing. One thing I said at the bottom is, and I think I wanted to get out of this is. This will put me in a position to help other people and once I'm in that position I would use it and the opportunity came up today that we had quite a lot of drinks and stuff left and when you've been in the position like yes I maybe wasn't sleeping rough rough but I was no the fear that it being put in a position where you know where to sleep and you don't know where you, where you're gonna go and you're just sitting there and in a way, I know how the, the homeless people do feel sitting there and seeing how much they appreciated it was means a million times more to me than anything, you know, and we were in a position to help people that were less fortunate and I'm sure a lot of us and or all of us and on this competition. It's smashed it. <laughs> oh, it's over. Well, no, we smashed it for ourselves. Yeah, yeah. I think this competition means more to some of us than others and I think this last few days it has shown. I, I, honestly, I, I'm really excited about the whole thing, like I'm just looking forward to it now. Um, I've got a bit of experience in these sort of things and yeah, I just want to just see like how these guys do it because I know they're very successful. So That's the only thing I want to get off my chest that I'm excited, really. I might not look it, I might look like a miserable bugger, but um, <laughs> especially on camera when I'm talking to people. But yeah, no, I'm excited. That's about it. <laughs> If anything, it's made this few days has made me strong, even stronger than I was coming into the competition, and that alone is something, something that I will take away straight away if I don't get through tomorrow. I've learned a lot about myself even more this last few days, and learned a lot about other people, and I think a lot of people have taken a lot out of the last few days, which I'm sure Sam wanted anyway. So I'll be both because it's a challenge because he wants to see um, who the leaders are, who's got some initiative and creativity and this will probably uh, cut that down for him. Yeah. I am excited, um, no matter the outcome really. Um, if it turns out I've not made it then as long as there's a decent reason why I'm just happy. I feel like I've learned a lot. Let's have a pat on the back. Obviously if anyone's on Facebook tonight and they should hit the clip then... I've been flipping in my beard. I'm gonna... <laughs> <laughs> oh I'm buzzing the car with it tomorrow. <laughs> I need to get a good night's sleep tonight. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's it, we're still here for jobs. I might get kicked off, so. Right, lads, I might come back up, I might not, but just in case. No problem, well, ladies and gentlemen. It's been a good weekend. Yeah. It's been good, and it's been bad, it's been emotional, it's been stressful the last few days, but we're, we've got here, and tomorrow's a new week, and new challenges are waiting, sure. And that's it. Welcome to the purge. May God be with you all.